shown are the parts that I use for my setup. 16 to 14 millimeter injector bosses, 14 to 11 millimeter injector top hats, 1100 cc injectors from FID, and the 11 millimeter Dota Racing fuel rail. I've posted the links to these products down below. When installing the top hats, make sure to lube the O-rings first to prevent any binding or ripping. A small amount of engine oil works well. Next, what I did was arrange the injectors in order according to the data sheet. The top injector being cylinder 1, then going down the list. If you look closely, you can see the injector number. This one reads 220752. And if we check, that's the top one on this sheet. I've already installed the injector bosses into the intake runners, making sure to use a little bit of RTV on the outside to prevent any vacuum leaks. Let's install the injectors into the fuel rail. Just like before, make sure to lube the O-rings beforehand. Repeat the process for the rest. I'll say it again, lube the O-rings before installation. Line each injector up into the bosses before trying to fully seat them. Once they're lined up, push on the fuel rail to fully seat the injectors into the bosses. You'll hear a little click usually. For my setup, I use a 3mm washer in between the fuel rail and mount to fully secure the rail without any play. The thickness of the washer will change depending on the length of injector that you purchase for your setup. In my instance, I bought the shortest injector length, so I ended up needing a 3mm washer. As always, thank you for watching and stay tuned to see more videos.